When integrating SAP Cloud applications like SAP Cloud Platform, SuccessFactors, or Conquer, the One Identity Manager Starling Connect platform is needed to integrate these cloud applications very fast and very easily into One Identity Manager. As you can see, these cloud applications from SAP are not the only cloud applications that are being supported by our cloud platform, but additional applications will also be supported. For this video series, we are focusing on the SAP Cloud Platform or the SAP Cloud applications like SuccessFactors or Conquer. These applications will be integrated by creating a connection from the uh, Starling Connect platform to the instance of the SAP Cloud application. In case of SuccessFactors, information like username and password and the success factors URL are required to connect to the SAP success factors instance. By setting up these parameters, a SCIM version 1 URL will be provided, which then will be used in the One Identity Manager connector configuration to access this endpoint, which will act as a proxy towards the actual success factors cloud application. So, when we switch to the, to the One Identity Manager connector configuration, the sync editor, we will see that a connection to success factors has already been configured. The target system information that are required to access the Starling Connect endpoint for SAP are the information that are being provided on the Starling Connect platform. Once this information has been uh, entered, the One Identity Manager connector is capable of synchronizing objects like groups and users from success factors. And this information will then be made available in One Identity Manager's uh, tables that then can be synchronized through another connector, which is the Cloud System Module connector into the One Identity Server. So a second connection instance will be needed to get these data from the temporary or preliminary database table into the actual database table to maintain this information. So once we synchronize this data into the One Identity Manager, we will have two instances. First, the universal cloud interface with the information about groups and user accounts in success factors and the cloud target system connector, which will contain the information as well. So we can assign uh, user accounts to groups, or we can create account definitions, assign these account definitions to employees. So these employees will get accounts in the cloud target system. So the provisioning into the cloud target system will go first to the cloud target system, which will trigger a creation of an account object in the universal uh, connector interface table space, and this will lead to the provisioning into the cloud service life success factors, SAP Cloud Platform or Conquer. 